bored, 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 bored. Attention, will Douglas please come to the manager's office? Will Douglas please come to the manager's office? Uh oh. Hey, have you guys seen Chewy? I'm worried about him. Okay, you're not listening. That's fine. Oh, man. Hello? Chewy! Oh, good. I was so nervous. Why? What happened to you? Not me. You. You got called up to the big boss. Oh, I know. You poor idiot. You're such a king. You poor idiot king. They fired you right to your face, and you're being so brave. They didn't fire me. Really? Really. Well, good. Because we rely on you for rent money. Yes, I know. I have an addiction to dollar store party favors. You know those little five packs of broken one-note harmonicas? Those parachute men where the parachutes don't open? And those Batman Forever stickers with little Ginger Jim Carrey on them? Hey! They called me up because apparently my grandfather passed away. Oh, no! Shut your words! I don't want you to embarrass me in front of these idiots. Really, man? See, now I'm embarrassed. And I need more food. Oh, I've heard of this. Grief eating. Yeah, gonna choke down all your emotions in the form of, uh, what do we got? Not exactly. <laughs> okay, get me one too. I'm not grief eating. I'm not sad. I didn't know him. But a grandfather? That's like your parents' dad. My parents didn't have the same dad. Anyway, my parents need me to stop by their DVD shop on the way home from work. Oh, of course. You can mourn as a family. No! They need me to watch the shop where they drop his lifeless body off a cliff. Oh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. How's it going? Fine. Well, not great. My tum is all wrecked from a confusing sandwich. And I think maybe I'm sad because somebody is dead, but mostly I'm just gassy. Stop! Stop. Um, Jonathan. Douglas. Chewy, am I a clown? Yes. There you have it. Forty dollars. Take it or leave it. All right. Here you go. But we'll be back in two hours, and you had better pop out of the box. For an extra ten dollars, I can scream bloody murder at the top of my lungs. No! Fine. I'll do it for free. What was that? We just made 40 bucks. How? We're throwing a little party for some stupid children. Uh, here? This place is dead. No one's buying anything, and your parents won't be back for hours. But... I'm gonna go down to the dollar store and buy party supplies. Wait. You're my best friend, and I need to be honest with you. We will not be making a profit on this. But... Bye! <laughs> Look what I got you from the dollar store. What is this? Oh, hi, Chewy. It's me, Ginger Jim. You're just a little chicken, huh? Cheap, cheap, cheap. Don't want to help me throw a party? This won't work on me. I won't help you. You know I would do anything for you. When it's convenient. And you would do anything for me. Because I'm an idiot. I just need you to help me get into this box. That way I can jump out of it and surprise the kids. Here. It's all the money that was left over. Five dollars. It's yours. Oh, all right. Let me give you a boost. Er uh, okay, so the kids will be here any minute. All you have to do is feed them cake and keep them entertained for like an hour or so. An hour? What kind of games are we going to play? Games, oh, yeah, games, games. Oh, yeah, what games? Uh, the sitting and eating cake game? Huh. Yeah! I mean, I'm gonna win. No. All right, well, maybe this won't be so bad. <laughs> I don't wanna win. Ow. My tummy's on fire. Stop that. Why are you so small and fat? I was in an accident. I got chewed. You look like a gross, 
idiot. You look really dumb. Dear diary, it's me. Today I fought children. Okay, let's get you away from the children, huh? Ma'am, is it all right if I weep openly in front of you? Oh, no. But hey, isn't it time for the clown? Yes, let's end this. Who wants to see one final surprise and then you all get out and never come back? Yeah! yeah. Here we go. Riddle me this, butt munch. Um, is he dead? That would solve all of my problems. Oh, no. Shut up! I mean, surprise! Okay, shh. I'm Roddy Meats the Clown. Roddy, Roddy Meats. Meats? Hey, Meat Clown, you smell like my dad. That's fair. You don't have a dad. Who wants to see a long thin balloon? Boo! Boo. Douglas, what have you done? Mom, Dad, Gumboy. I thought you were more responsible than this. Sorry, Dad. Yeah, sorry, Dad. Don't call me Dad, you sad, weird meat clown. The worst part about all of this is that your grandfather left you an inheritance. He did. Yeah, two hundred dollars. Which won't even begin to cover the damages you've caused to our shop. I'm keeping the inheritance, and I'll let you know how much more you owe me once I've figured that out. Thanks, Dad. I'm real sorry. Come on, come boy. Let's go home. Okay. Hey, do you still have that five dollars I gave you? Yeah. Good. On the way home, let's buy more of those sandwiches. It made me barf, but I think I like it. Me too, buddy. Me too.